Using the standard reduction table, write the balanced net ionic equation for the reaction that occurs for combining chlorine gas with silver metal. So we're going to look at the standard reduction table here and see where these species are. Now remember, we're given chlorine gas, which you'll find up here on the table, and silver metal. So this is not the ion version of silver, but the metal version of silver. And we can see here, this forms that backslash approach that we've seen in our notes. This means that this could be a spontaneous reaction. Now, to write the balanced equation for this, we know that we are going to be working with chlorine, and there are two chloride ions that are made there. And we can see that silver will be oxidizing. So we're going to write it the reverse way. So we start with silver and we're going to be making silver ion. Now, in order to balance this, I can see all my species, but I need to make sure those electrons balance out. There are two in the chlorine reaction, only one in the silver. So I need to multiply all of these parts there by two. So when I go and balance this, I can take the chlorine from the first reaction plus two silver from the second reaction. I'm not going to bother writing the electrons in because we've balanced them. So that means there will be two electrons on the reactant side, two electrons on the product side. So they would just cancel out. And then I'm going to get two chloride ions plus two silver ions ions. And as I said, the electrons have cancelled out. Now there's no spectators present here, so this would now be the balanced net ionic equation for the combination of these two in a redox reaction.